My lords and ladies of the Landsmeet, Tyrn Loghain would have us give up our freedoms, our traditions, out of fear. He placed us on this path, yet we should place our destiny in his hands? Must we sacrifice everything good about our nation to save it? A fine performance, Aemon. <laughs> but no one here is taken in by it. You would attempt to put a puppet on the throne, and every soul here knows it. The better question is who will pull the strings. Ah! Here we have the puppeteer. Tell us, Warden, how will the Orlesians take our nation from us? Will they deign to send their troops, or simply issue their commands through this would-be prince? What do they offer you? How much is the price of Ferelden honor now? There are enough refugees in Mybanor now to make that abundantly clear. The South has fallen, Loghain. Will you let Darkspawn take the whole country for fear of Orlay? The Blight is indeed real, Wolf. But do we need Grey Wardens to fight it? They claim that they alone can end the Blight. Yet they failed spectacularly against the Darkspawn at Ostagar. And they asked to bring with them four legions of Chevaliers. And once we open our borders to the Chevaliers, and we really expect them to simply return from whence they came. What's this? There is no slavery in Ferelden. Explain yourself. There is no saving the alienage. Damage from the riots has yet to be repaired. There are bodies still rotting in their homes. It is not a place I would send my worst enemy. There is no chance of holding it if the Blight comes here. Despite what you may think, Warden, I have done my duty. Whatever my regrets may be for the Elves, I have done what was needed for the good of Ferelden. Indeed. Do we not owe it to Merrick to see his son on the throne? If he were a true son of Merrick, I would not hesitate to swear fealty to him. But I see nothing of Merrick in this pup. But enough of this. I have a question for you, Warden. What have you done with my daughter? You took my daughter, our queen, by force. Killing her guards in the process. What arts have you employed to keep her? Does she even still live? I believe I can speak for myself. <gasps> Lords and ladies of Ferelden, hear me. My father is no longer the man you know. This man is not the hero of Riverdale. This man turned his troops aside and refused to protect your king as he fought bravely against the Darkspawn. This man seized Kaelin's throne before his body was cold and locked me away so I could not reveal his treachery. I would have already been killed, if not for this Grey Warden. So, the Warden's influence has poisoned even your mind, Enora. I wanted to protect you from this. My lords and ladies! Our land has been threatened before! It's been invaded and lost and won times beyond counting. We Ferelden's have proven that we will never truly be conquered so long as we are united. We must not let ourselves be divided now. Stand with me! And we shall defeat even the Blight itself! The Warden. I'm with the Warden. Southreach stands with the Grey Wardens. The Warden helped me personally in a family matter. Waking Sea stands with the Grey Warden. Dragon's Peak supports the Warden. The Western Hills throw their lot in with the Wardens. Make her help us. I stand by Loghain. We've no hope of victory otherwise. I stand with the Warden. The Blight is coming. We need the Grey Wardens. Traitors! Which of you stood against the Orlesian Emperor when his troops flattened your fields and raped your wives? You fought with us once, Eamon. You cared about this land once. 
before you got too old and fat and content to even see what you risk. None of you deserve a say in what happens here. None of you have spilled blood for this land the way I have. How dare you judge me? Then, let us end this. I suppose we both knew it would come to this. When we first met at Ostagar, I would never have thought so. But Ostagar seems like it happened in another lifetime to someone else. A man is made by the quality of his enemies. Marek told me that once. I wonder if it's more a compliment to you or me. Enough! Let the Landsmeet declare the terms of the duel. It shall be fought according to tradition. A test of arms, in single combat until one party yields. And we, who are assembled, will abide by the outcome. Will you face me yourself, or have you a champion? It is you or me the men will follow. So, let us fight for it. Prepare yourself. Estimated you, Warden. I thought you were like Kalen, a child wanting to play at war. I was wrong. There's a strength in you that I have not seen anywhere since Marek died. I yield. I didn't just hear you say that. You're going to let him live? After everything he's done? Kill him already! Wait, there is another option. The Tairn is a warrior and general of renown. Let him be of use. Let him go through the joining. There are three of us in all of Ferelden. And there are compelling reasons to have as many Wardens on hand as possible to deal with the Archdemon. The joining itself is often fatal, is it not? If he survives, you gain a general. If not, you have your revenge. Doesn't that satisfy you? Absolutely not! Riordan, this man abandoned our brothers and then blamed us for the deed. He hunted us down like animals. He tortured you. How can we simply forget that? Joining the Wardens is an honor, not a punishment. Name him a Warden and you cheapen us all. I will not stand next to him as a brother. I won't. Some things can't be undone or forgiven. This goes way beyond having spotless honor. We aren't talking about a minor hiccup in his past. I didn't want to be king. I still don't. But if that's what it takes to see Loghain get justice, then I'll do it. I'll take the crown. Listen to this. Can you see how disastrous a king he'd be? Putting his own selfish desires above the needs of his country? You can't seriously support him. My husband, the King Consort, the General of my armies, and the hero who will save Ferelden from this blight. You're siding with her? How could you do this to me? You, of all people. I did once. You're the one who convinced me differently, if you recall. You said I should stand up for myself. Well, I'm standing. Here I am. Make me king, not her. Being a good king is about more than the right breeding! And I thought we were friends. I guess I was wrong. Here's my decision then. I'm no longer a Grey Warden. I'm leaving. I'm afraid it's not so simple as that, Alistair. You already got what you wanted. Your murdering father gets a place amongst the Grey Wardens. What else could you want from me? Your life, unfortunately. 
So long as you live, rebellions can be raised in your name. Our land cannot endure another civil war. I must call for your execution. You're probably right. The job wasn't finished at Ostagar after all. And it should be. Just to be on the safe side. I thought we were friends. I guess now's as good a time as any to find out what that's worth. One day I hope you get what's coming to you. All of you! Guards, take him away, please. And now, lords and ladies of Ferelden, there is still a blight to defeat, and armies to gather. And I appoint this man to lead us in both. We will not allow this land be further threatened by the Archdemon. Gather your forces and await the King Consort's command. On the morrow, we shall begin our struggle against the greatest threat Ferelden has ever faced. And we shall triumph over it, for we are Ferelden. You are called upon to submit yourself to the taint for the greater good. From this moment forth, you are a Grey Warden. I... understand. So it's done. My father lives, and for good or ill, he is now a Grey Warden. Thank you for giving him the opportunity to undergo the ritual. It couldn't have been easy. As he always has, I'm simply glad that it didn't result in a sad end for a great man. You kept your end of the deal. I will keep mine. The engagement will be announced at my coronation, provided you are still interested. It gets you near the throne. I am the Queen, and you are my consort. Remember that, and we will have no issue. Arl Eamon has left for Redcliffe, and tells me that our armies have almost fully gathered there. I will be heading there myself. Bring your companions, and join us at Redcliffe Castle as soon as you are able. You have united for Elden Warden. Now we face the Blight. <laughs> <laughs> 